Hey Royal fans, today's headline. Meghan and Harry's Netflix projects shunned. About as exciting as gluten-free muffins. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are set to be thrust back under the spotlight ahead of a new film on US cable network. Many have criticized the show titled Harry and Meghan Escape in the Palace that depicts Meghan lying injured among the wreckage of an overturned car during a nightmare in the first scenes. Supporters of both the royal family and the Sussexes described the scene, which had many similarities to the tragic car crash that killed Prince William and Harry's mother Diana, Princess of Wales, as tacky and crass. Neither Meghan nor Harry have shared their thoughts on the sequence. The pair are currently hard at work producing a range of projects. This includes a children's series and documentary as part of their mammoth £109 million deal with Netflix. Despite having signed the contract last year, the pair have announced just two projects. While Harry is working on Heart of Invictus, which will follow competitors in the 2022 Invictus Games, Megan is preparing Pearl, an animated series that will see a 12-year-old girl's heroic adventures as she talks to noteworthy women from history. Given the large team they have employed to help create their projects with Archwell Productions, many have questioned what could be taking the pair so long, especially after reports emerged that suggested Megan May have been working on Pearl since 2018. Daniela Alsa, a commentator who regularly writes about the royal family, recently wrote a piece titled Harry and Meghan's plans for 2021 are in ruins for the New Zealand Herald. She chronicled all of the mishaps which have inflicted the pair, including a heightened family feud following their bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey, as well as Harry's various appearances in broadcast interviews. Ms. Alsa also noted the lack of published and announced Netflix works. Brutally, she commented, Despite their rumored 100 million plus pound Netflix deal hitting the one year mark next week, the couple have not released a single piece of content. The only shows they have announced are a documentary about Harry's charity Invictus and an animated series called Pearl, which according to the Daily Telegraph has been in the pipeline since 2018. Sounds about as exciting as a gluten-free brand muffin. Others have shared similar views and suggested Netflix may be expecting more from the duo. At the time of the announcement, however, many were enraged that Meghan and Harry had managed to secure the contract. Jane Moore of Loose Woman said it had irritated her to see the couple picked up over young talent. Asked whether they deserved it, she said no, end of discussion. She continued, it irritates the hell out of me. I'm a writer myself. I know there are so many writers and producers. There is so much young talent out there trying to come through who would love to get into Netflix store, let alone be given this deal. They have been given this deal because of who they are, not because of what they have proved they can do. Thank you for watching. Please do like, comment and subscribe for more.